Welcome to Ride Out TV. Having the engine ready to put back in, as you saw in the last episode. It's now time to prepare the frame for his new life as a cafe fighter. You have already seen, that I cut the brackets and other parts, that I don't need. But now I need to weld all holes, to have a clean optic on the frame. Like this, and this, and these. In addition, this loop will find his place. So let's go. Looks not too bad. And now, is welding. We are getting there. This plate is for the seat panel, and for the license plate holder, since this bike won't get a rear fender. The frame also gets some new threaded bolts on the inside, for the electronic case, that I still need to build. This one is for the horn, that will be placed nearly invisible. I am very happy with the result and how clean it looks. So what else do we need? The first thing is a protection for the chain. Time to get my drawing skills out again. This is only a test, but instead of painting it just black, is this a good solution? The next point was the tank holder, that now must be screwed on the inside instead of the top. So I changed it a bit.
last but not least, the electronic case, that should be as small as possible. I also added a bracket for the rear brake tank. It fits perfect. Ready for painting. Like all the other parts. In the next episode. See you next time on Ride Out TV. If you like to support this channel, I would appreciate if you subscribe and leave a comment. Thank you.